Today, as you know, we saw lots of heavy rain across western Massachusetts. 22 News reporter Kiara Smith went to Westfield to see how the rain impacted that city. Well, it's either cooking me with the heat or drowning me with the rain. Um, the amount of rain has been crazy. It's been overfilling my pool. Have to keep pumping it. Keeps killing my filter. It's been a rough, rough summer so far. After several days of rain and a flash flood warning, rivers across western Massachusetts overflowed, and there were some dangerous road conditions that led to closures of East Mountain Road and Route 20 in Westfield. Michelle from Westfield says it's important to check your local weather before leaving the house. I know I'll look on my weather forecast on my phone first and just to see where there could be possible conditions that aren't worth driving through, and then I'll take alternate routes to get through because I know Westfield has a lot of flooding spots. And due to the high water levels and debris from the rain, the Massachusetts State Police is advising people to avoid river activities until the water goes down. Here at the Westfield River, the water is very high, muddy, and is moving very quickly. And there are also some tree branches floating in the water. And when water levels are high, the current is also likely to be strong. This can put people more at risk of accidents on the water. High water can cause debris jams and it can also hide submerged infrastructures. In the meantime, safety officials are asking that people avoid swimming and boating. Working for you, Kiara Smith, 22 News.